no, no, come here and tell a story that we can all laugh about, that me and you have both experienced as like stupid people as we are. I don't know. We were, okay. <laughs> <laughs> Let's talk about Benito for a little bit. Benito for a little bit. And uh, <laughs> I present to you Emanol and Sergio, aka the Ghetto Brother. No, it's the pressure one, it's the pressure two. How many times we gotta run you through this? I've had enough. You're not in your life.
Um, <laughs> but it, it goes, it goes a little sad. Oh! Okay, oh, okay. One time, I was like super sick, right? My stomach was hurting, right? We're in the car. I'm in my mom's van, right? I'm in the back of the car because I'm taking the baby. Right? So I'm literally clip off the belt, stand up, and run around the little tiny broken car that we had. Bro, you're little, 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 you are little 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 you
Angie, I'll tell your story. No. I still want to hear this story, though. Which one? The one you're about to tell. Uh, well, Mr. Emmons is a dangerous grown man who's a teacher. Who's afraid of losing his job to begin with. Huh? Well, I'm afraid of losing my job to begin with. He walks like his cheeks are clenched. <laughs> Hey, Cass. Hey, Foster. Time to warm up. Aww. Oh. 